All right, y'all, the CDC has warned against getting too comfortable with the coronavirus, especially uh, with new variants spreading. Uh, we can completely lose the hard-earned progress that we made. Uh, but that is not stopping the governors of Texas and Mississippi. They both announced yesterday that they will lift their state's mask mandates and roll back many of their COVID-19 health restrictions. Uh, and they're going to put uh, health restrictions that was put in place Last March, um, uh, Texas Governor Greg Abbott said that it is now time to open Texas 100 percent, adding that, quote, uh, it is clear from the recoveries, from the vaccinations, from uh, the reduced hospital hospital hospitalizations. Gary, is that right? Hospitalization. Yep. Hospitalization. You said it perfectly, Ricky. OK, th- thank you. Because, uh, you know, Gary behaved me, made me nervous. He behaved. You, you were right. Yeah. <laughs> and from the safe practices that Texas are using, uh, that state mandates are no longer needed, end quote. Now, Mississippi Governor Tate Reeves, Tate Reeves has plans to end the statewide mask mandate effective today. So what do you think? Now, is it too soon for states to get back to normal or is it about time? Give us a call at 866-9-R-I-C-K-E-Y and let us know what you think. Uh, Eva, what do y'all think? I think this lack of caution is just criminal. Like, I get it, and I, I, I am very excited about hospitalizations going down, doses, um, diagnosis going down, and doses of vaccines getting in people's arms. But to reopen everything with no mask mandate, which means kids go to school with no masks, which means you get served food by people with no masks, absolutely not. I will not be in the yeah. state of Texas no time soon. Yeah, that's crazy. Brand. Everybody is not vaccinated yet, so I think this is absolutely crazy. And I think the new normal is wearing a mask. You just feel more safe now protecting your face and your organs that are, like, open where you can get those germs and catch anything. All right. What about you, Gary? I want us to go back, but, you know, wearing a mask would be nice. But, oh, I'm sure ready to go back, honey. I'm sure ready to go back, honey. I'm sure ready to go back, honey. It's, oh, especially, no. Kay, you were saying something about the mask. What, are you, what, what were you saying about those masks I, what, and what they cover up? Well, well, the masks do serve a benefit because they make ugly, ugly chicks only have to be cute from like the bridge of the nose up, <laughs> and so it's easier for chicks that are facially challenged to get through, you know, to get through the day and, and be on par with the good-looking chicks because it's, it's not hard to be cute from the and nose up. And it's the up. same way with y'all. It really is. Yeah. It's the same way with no, but I'm saying, but I'm, like but you I'm can have pretty eyes and bread. nice brows and nice hair, and you yeah, pull that you thing down. Have. You got a bell pepper nose, brown, nasty, rotten out that's teeth. All you got to you, you can't even tell. It just so levels it's the same playing playing way field. with y'all. Yeah. I just don't just know what just happened. We was having an intelligent conversation, intelligent, and Special K and the brat just ruined everything. Let's go to the phone lines. Eight six six nine. Ricky, 866-9-R-I-C-K-E-Y. Good morning. Okay, I think it's too soon. Um, we have too many people who are still dying. They are very inconsiderate for not thinking of the people and just thinking of the businesses. I think they need to reconsider that and be more considerate of the health of us Texans and the people of Mississippi. It's entirely too soon. I am a resident of Mississippi, and the only reason the numbers plummeted because of the bad weather two weeks ago. We had to stay inside. There were icy roads, so there was nowhere to go. It's entirely too soon. I'm also an advocate for the vaccine, but it's way too soon. Mississippi so for this. I love my home state, but it's embarrassing. Thanks. Oh, it's definitely too soon because the population uh, is 10%, it's not even 10% uh, vaccinated yet. That doesn't even make any sense for them to be uh, releasing people like that. Like, would you go into a yard with an animal and the, and the leash is only 10% uh, working? I, I, I just don't get that. <laughs> it's right. absolutely too soon. Okay. And they can keep asking in Texas and Mississippi because we don't want that anywhere else. Don't come to Louisiana. We good. We good over here. <laughs> Wait a minute, how y'all, how y'all gonna get messy like that? Don't do that. That is not the state of her house. Stay where you live, my people. Don't come over here. Don't come to Louisiana. We good. <laughs> you know people in their car in the Texas laughing like, damn. Yeah, yes. No, nah, man. Uh, you know we just the effect on the airports. Oh yeah, we just want yeah. every, right, right. We want everybody to be safe, man. Uh, I don't care what the governors yeah. do. Protect yourself. Put on a couple of masks until you can get vaccinated. Johnson and Johnson. Uh, they have hooked up with another uh, their co- competitive, uh, another competitive drug company. Not Moderna. It was another one. It's Merck. Uh, Merck, 
And uh, they uh, by the end of May, the vaccination will be available for every adult in the United States. So if you're out there, go ahead and get on the list because I promise you, you will get an email back within a week or a week and a half, um, you know, uh, uh, to get yourself vaccinated where you can get some immunity. Uh, is that was that the right word? Was that right? Immunity. Yeah. All right, Gary, you be making me nervous because you like to criticize people on their words just because your vocabulary ain't. I, I, and I don't like that. <laughs> And, you know, it make me uncomfortable sometimes. Sometimes I just wish that you would just not look at me when I'm trying to say big words. Well, I just wish you would break them down in syllables then. Break them down in syllables. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. I hate you. I hate you. Like, why do you come every day? Why do you show up? Why don't you do like Black Break Tony and just take her? Immunization. <laughs> yeah, that hospital. Hosp, hospital hospitalization. Hospitalization. It threw me off. And I'm then just you tight. flow in. Say then what? You flow in. Hospitalization. Then you flow in. Hospitalization. Karen, them big ass teeth you got, you couldn't even say it just then. <laughs> <laughs>